Hey, sneaking us back here. Back again. Back, 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 back. Today we have for you a Manjaro Mate Edition. I thought, well, we'll give the old, the old uh, different ones a bit of a go. Okay. We've done the basic XFCE Manjaro and the open box and all the others. There are other desktops to go with them from the, how can we say, the community. They're from the community. Oh, yeah. So this is the mate desktop because it's a bit of a your mate. As you can see, it's the usual. It gives a bit of the old known to experience, basically. So, give a quick go through of you. Down here on my right hand side are my four desktops. One, two, three, and four. Down here we have click to idle windows. Up in the top corner of my volume and my ethernet. And then up here we have a start menu, which is applications, places, and system. Okay. And if you've used the GNOME 2, you'll know what you're talking about. Now, I've not actually installed anything apart from what comes on, and I've updated the 230 odd update. Oh, sorry, 280 odd updates it needed doing. So yeah, we'll have a quick go through. So, applications, what do you get? You don't actually get too much for this version of Manjaro, although it is CD size. So under accessories, we get this Ender Grandpa Archive Manager, HP Device Manager for all your printing stuff, the Mate Calculator. What's different about the Mate Calculator? Nothing really, okay. A bit further down, we go to Add Graphics. You get a PDF viewer, you get Eye of Mate, Image Viewer, and View Noir. Okay, View Noir, yeah, lovely. Under Internet, we get Havahi, Havahi, and then Firefox, Pigeon, Thunderbird, Transmission, and XChat. So if you're on like Firefox, then we'll see what goes down. I'm not a bit of drinkage while we're doing that. Hang on a second. Mm. It is slightly sluggish, but hey, maybe some recording at the same time. Normally, Manjaro is super duper fast, you find. Okay. So here we are, Manjaro Linux. Go to the community and get all the staff. Get Manjaro. So if we go click Get Manjaro. There's the basic XFC version, there's the open box version, they're both very good. You get the net install version, some of you may like that. And you've got the Manjaro Cinema and GNOME version, and the KDE, and other communities. Okay, that's all right, that's all right, yeah. I didn't want to go with it, so I'm not really fussed about Cinema personally, that's why I didn't go with that one. So if you scroll down even further, other community releases, we'll go to here and you'll see what I mean. I've tried the E17, it doesn't want to install for a start. But the mate, yeah, I've tried the KDE and the LXD. They're all very, very good. Oh, I actually rather like the LXD version. It's rather nice. Yes, I'm fine. Should come with all your codecs that you require. So we're going to have a look. Okay, we're going to the Blubber Cur. So it's getting pretty spicy now. It's getting boom, boom, boom. Yeah, I'm, I'm liking. I'm liking, yeah, it's all right. So BBC comes up. All right, we go to the news. It's more intensive. Remember, you can make them bigger or smaller. It's entirely up to you. It works for me okay so that's all right so the fox works super fine under office we get a dictionary LibreOffice, LibreOffice calc and LibreOffice writer you do not get the full business you'll have to go into the pac-man thing to go and get all that all right but, but should we try what see how right comes up oh that's it well that, that was pretty sprightly that was all right wasn't it lovely mm. Mm, sort of lemonade mm. as you'll see full screen works rather nice Obviously, you have to adjust the size, your, your, your resolution. Yeah. Anyway. Moving on. And the program, you get the QT Assistant, QT Designer, QT Linguist, and QT DD Bus Viewer. Under Sound and Video, Brazero as standard, QT V4 L2 Test Utility, VLC Media Player, and X Noise for your music. X Noise isn't too bad, really. I mean, I'm not moaning about it, but it's not what I would you know, do. As you can see, I've never started it before because it's taking its time. We're going to skip that bit. But basically, this is what it looks like. Yeah, so I'll go to help, and you'll see what I mean. I'll go to about, X noise, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, it works. It does what it says on Latin. Now, as far as I know, you can't actually record from a disc from here, but I can't remember that. Media collection, blah, 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 lyrics, blah, 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 blah. No, I don't think it does that, does it? But anyway, who cares? Media, no. Oh, you can add removal with you, but I'm not sure if that'll do a proper workage for me. Okay. Oh, we better close him down from up there. Okay. Go away. And exit. Thank you. Okay, send the video again. That's all you get. And under system tools, add and remove software, of course. Config LXDM, lovely. Mate system monitor. We'll open it up and you can have a little look for yourselves. As you can see, it's not using too much CPU, but it is using 211 of meg of memory. And this is why I tend to use XFC or LXD. For that simple reason, yeah, no other reason at all. No, 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 there ain't no other reason, honest. No, not at all. 
What else we got down here? The mate terminal, power statistics, software updater, don't need to do that. And Sousa Studio Image Writer. So maybe Sousa Studio. Yeah, okay. So add and remove software. We'll have a quick check out there before we do anything else. Mm. Yeah, a bit of refreshage. Mm -hmm. Just in case. I've not done it before. I've only just updated it. I've been on the system for a couple of days, but I just haven't got around to doing it. So in theory, if so I put in here, open shot, it should, in theory, come up with open shot 143-2. So yeah, all you do, click the box, like so, apply, and off you go. It's easy as pie. And try to make it as easy as possible using Manjaro. I've done away with a terminal install. You have got a GUI for stuff. Okay, places. Having folder desktop, computer, network, connect to server, search for files. All those you will do in GNOME 2. Preferences, your flash manager. Tell you about it, you know what I'm saying? Manjaro settings manager. Should we look at that? Yeah, go on, we have a look. Might as well while we're here, mine. I should hear my washing machine going off in the background. And it wants my password. Hmm. Just your language packs, user account, and keyboard settings. Okay, that's fine. What else I'll show you there? There's nothing really new to show you, but if you fancy a bit of mate or a bit of old school gnome too, you're going to like this, aren't you? Really? Under administration, it's just your print settings. Then you have the control center. That's a bit better. You know what it looks like. It looks like this. Yes. Go to my monitor. In theory, if I click it once, there we are. There's my monitor. 1920 by 18, sorry, 1920 by 1080. What am I talking about? I'm on drugs. Okay. That's all I can show you for Manjaro Mate. Yeah. If you will like the Mate desktop, you're going to like it. If you don't, you're going to use something else. I'm going to rate it about 85, just because I'm not particularly fond of Mate, although I prefer it over Cinnamon. Yeah, it's lovely. Sneaky. Linux Ganeth. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.